Hello everybody, Dr. Steve here. So excited to be with you here today. I'm uh, here with a great friend at the MLSP convention here. Her name is Diane Hockman. She uh, hails from Brooklyn, USA. Yay! <laughs> and uh, so happy to introduce her. And um, hi Diane, how are you doing today? I'm good Steve, how are you? That's great. I wanted to, um, I, I've really been impressed by the way that you connect with people. Mm -hmm. And I know there are a lot of people out there who really have problems and I think yep. everything starts with that. And I'd just like to hear your take on that for a couple of minutes here. Absolutely. You know, I really, um, when I started out in this industry, that was my biggest problem. I was really shy and I had a hard time just approaching people and talking to people. And I had a great mentor that one day he said to me, listen, step away from your business for a minute and what I want you to do is to go and stop in gas stations or 7-elevens or wherever and I want you to start talking to people and meeting people and finding out usually by looking at someone you can tell a little bit about them like if I look at you I can tell just by your outfit you're kind of like a preppier guy you're this I listen to you I can tell you're from New York and the area so and just start talking to people about things that are important to them and get them to connect with you don't try to sell them don't try to get them don't try to do all this stuff and he said master that because if you can master having people falling in love with you is what he said you'll do really well then when you turn back to your business because the people come first so being I don't know the, the naive kid I didn't doubt him I didn't question him I just started going out to um, to all these places and practicing and I noticed like a woman would have on a mother's ring and I'd say, oh wait, what months are those? And you have four kids and you know, cause it was something she was wearing or, or you know, whatever jewelry she's wearing or whatever else. And um, you know, I just got good at it and I realized one day when I connected with her, I went into a gas station, I was practicing and there was a young man and he was covered head to toe in tattoos and he had those big gauges in his ears and somebody that who just wouldn't be somebody I normally relate with and all I did was ask him I said oh my gosh did you plan those out the tattoos did you plan those out or you know you know or did you just add on as you went and he started telling me all about his tattoos and it actually was fascinating I don't want any because they hurt but yeah. but it was fascinating and the guy like like literally when I was leaving he's like please come back and visit again and I realized I had figured it out you connected so, with him yeah, on, I, a, on a topic And somebody that's... so different than me and yeah. somebody that, like, you know, a lot of people would look at him and be scared and he was the nicest guy in the world. Mm -hmm. All I did was I looked at, obviously if you put a lot of tattoos on your body, that's something important to you. Obviously if you're wearing a mother's ring okay. with certain stones, it's something important to you. Obviously if you're wearing, um, like I'm wearing an iHeart MLSP shirt today because we're at mm -hmm. the convention, you know, what's MLSP? So when we focus on the other person and ask them a question, mm -hmm. usually they're going to like us. Great tips. Long wow. answer or two, but but it's it's that's all it is. Okay, and and it's great tips either online or offline. Absolutely, because you can do it online on Facebook because people have pictures on their on their wall and you can see what they're into and you know most people are like asking them about business and I'm like oh my God your dog is so cute is that a poodle you know or is that a you know a pug or what is it and then they tell you and you know you, you get into conversation. All right, thank you so much, You're Diane. Welcome. Been a pleasure. See you later.